charged, bro. Yeah, I charged this shit last night, bro. This shit's fucking... This shit's about to fucking rip. Do you guys think Hex and Scump lawsuit is a catalyst for the entry fees paid by orgs being paid back recently? Now, I'm gonna be honest. I don't know if that has anything to do with this. I think it's two different situations, guys. I don't think it has anything to do with it, right? Are, do, are they connected in any way? Is the, is the, the Hector Scump lawsuit connected in any way to the changes of the cdl i don't know guys i honestly don't really know on this i don't i'm not even too sure if it's connected in any way shape or form if it is connected hey shout out to fucking set energy hey shout out to these motherfuckies you know what i'm saying some people are saying it's not connected some people are saying it's 100 connected i really don't know but if it is connected shout out to these guys you know what i mean i'll be honest with you guys i'll be honest with you i don't think it connects guys i don't i don't think it connects because their whole problem was with their, their whole thing was was completely different. You know what I'm saying? Their whole thing was, I don't... Isolate said 100% connected in some way. Isolate, do you know how? Isolate, how are they connected in, in some way, Isolate? How are they connected? Do you know? Drop it in the chat, bro. Love these early streams? Hey, let's get it, E-Red. I woke up early today. I woke up at like 9 a.m. today, 8.30. I got, I got to bed early last night. You know what I mean? Isolate, I would love to know. I would love to know your answer on how you think they're connected, bro. I would love to know. You know what I mean? Because I'm I'm actually curious. You know what I mean? Sandy, don't come in. Sandy, don't come in here and start throwing fucking tomatoes in here, bro. Don't come in here and start fucking throwing tomatoes. We're not doing this, Sandy. We're not fucking doing this right now. Okay? You know what I mean? They were suing because of... Where's Isolate? What happened? Isolate blacked out? Did he black out, guys? Is he fucking blacked? Can we do this now? What is this? Is he blacked out? What the fuck is this? This year's Call of Duty Championships will take place from September 1st through the 4th at Call of Duty XP. Players from Europe, Australia, New Zealand, and North America will be competing for the largest cash prize in Call of Duty history. There I was. Teams for this year's tournament have qualified based on their placings across Stage 1 and Stage 2 finals. Other teams have qualified based oh, on placing high enough in the Call of Duty World League online qualification. Oh, the regions shit. are rated based on the strength of each of the three Call of Duty World League regions. Europe gets 12 spots. North America gets 16 spots. And Australia and New Zealand gets the remaining four spots. The 32 teams oh, are placed fuck. into four separate pods. Oh, fuck. Pot A includes the 16 teams the don't most give a points fuck. in the North American Call of Duty World League standings. I don't give a fuck, Scrap. Teams in the European standings. It's what happens. Pod B consists Scrappy, of let me tell you something about my papaya smoking. Let me tell you something about my papaya smoking. Okay. I earned the fact that I can hit the papaya now anytime I want. I earned that privilege. I earned that. I earned that. Okay? I didn't always do that. I didn't always do that. I didn't always rip that papaya. I didn't always rip that shit every fucking day. You know what I mean? Now, I know you guys see Mama Zuma in the chat. Don't worry about it. That might be AI. That might be AI. That might be a fake Mama Zuma right there. I don't know if that's the real Mama Zuma right there. I don't know if that's the real one right there. Okay? I don't know. You know? That might be AI Mama right there. <laughs> you know? But Scrappy, you lucky mom. Scrappy, I'm going to cook you later, Scrap. You're lucky my mom's in here. Scrap, I'm going I'm to deal with you later, Scrap. You're lucky my mom's in here. You're lucky. You're lucky. You know what I mean? My mom doesn't like me smoking on stream either. W mom. Yeah, your mom will be yelling at you too for that. Yeah, la, my mom be, you know, she be yelling so at me. Wait, good, good. Hey, she would be really happy if she saw my bed though. Cause I, guys, I deep cleaned my place yesterday. I deep cleaned the whole fucking place. My bed looks absolutely spiffy. My bed looks spiffy. The couch is fluffed. Guys, I fluffed the couch. I fluffed it. I fluffed the couch. Boom. Fluffed it. Boom. Smoothed it out. Boom. You know what I mean? You know what I fucking... Come on, are you fucking kidding me? Did you blow the... Come on, bro. Come on, the bro. North American teams. The next two Somebody said W made, bro. I don't have... Europe. Well, I do have maids. I do have maids, but I was the maid yesterday. Me. It was me, guys. Pod it was me. The final six Boom. qualifiers from North America. You know what I mean? And the number five and number six ranked teams from Europe. And finally, Pod D consists of the final six teams from Europe, as well as the final two qualifiers from Australia. Lose two. You go home. Will we see Scump it's win his Scumpy. first ring and Karma win his third? Or will a team from Europe or Australia New Zealand stun the Call of Duty community by taking a ring overseas? The hell Tune in September 1st through 4th for all the action.
They right here, dude. Guys, guys, look. You can see me. You can see that nose. You can see the nose peeking out from behind it. You can see the fucking nose peeking out. Look at that. Come on, son. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me, bro? Are you kidding me? Refresh Reddit. Listen, if I refresh Reddit, there better be something good here, bro. If I refresh Reddit and I see some bullshit, I'm going to be pissed, bro. The CEO of Space Station says if COD were to expand, they would be interested. Okay, so this is where it gets interesting. This is where it gets interesting, guys. Okay? First, let, let, let's find Just, let's find this fucking thing real quick. Let, no, let, let's find this shit real quick. Let's, let's start with this, because everybody's talking about this right now, bro. Everybody's talking about this shit. You know what I mean? Where is this shit, bro? Where is this shit? Did I pass it? I think I patched it. Did I pass that shit? L city based model. Nah, I like the city based model though. Okay, right here. <clears throat> Major changes to the CDL going forward. Okay, one outstanding entry fees will be eliminated. Okay, teams will earn increased revenue tied to the sale of their in game merchandise. Okay, hold on. Let's expand on the first thing first. Okay, I am pretty sure that. Any money that has been paid to the league will be refunded. Okay, that is what I've been being told, guys. Right? So, correct, guys? That's correct. Car, that's correct, Car. That's right, right? Stone, that's right. So, any money that any CDL... Because you guys are going to have to help me here because I don't know what the fuck's going on. I just woke up. So, any CDL team that has paid money to buy into the league has been refunded now. So, their money's been completely refunded. Which is a massive W. Guys, that is a huge fucking W. That's a lot of cash that was that was spent to fuck you know what I mean? It's a lot of money. So like that's a W. Clearly they're thinking about the teams now. Clearly they're they're trying to get on the same page here and and, and work something out. Teams will earn increased revenue tied to the sale of their in-game merchandise, team bundles, and now the champs bundle as well, which is fantastic. Because I know that a big thing was they weren't seeing enough revenue share of the in-game items. And the fact that they're going to get a more per, uh, a bigger percentage of that is another W, bro. I mean, CDL teams are just going to eat even more, you know, which is good. That's We want the CDL teams to eat so they're not getting fucking slammed. It can, they need to be able to make money. You know what I mean? Hey, Gizma! Hey, Gizma! Hey! Come here! Come here. Come here. Come here. Hey. Come here. No. Come here. Come here. Wait. Hey, what did I? Hey. No. Come here. What did I tell you, bro? Hey. What did I tell you, bro? You gotta stop. No, you gotta stop barking. You gotta stop barking, bro. What did I tell you, man? No, no more barking, okay? No more. No more. There he goes. There he goes. And then he sprints off. And then he sprints off. Like, then he sprints off. There he goes. What's wrong with it? Guys, how do I get him to stop barking? How do I get him to stop? Do I just gotta keep talking to him? Should I just keep talking to him? Like, oh, you know what I mean? Control. Should I throw? Let him talk his shit. But Tiff, here's the problem, right? Here's the fucking problem. He, he be doing it all fucking day. Tiff, he talks shit all day, Tiff. He is talking shit all fucking day. You know, like he's got, yeah, he's got a lot to say. Yeah, he's got a lot to say. You know what I mean? Outside, here's the thing, Rated. Right? Here's the thing. I just went on a 30-minute walk with Gizmo before I went live. Before I went live. Put him outside. Oh, Rated, I thought you meant walk him. You want me to place him outside and come back inside? And fuck, Are you out of your fucking mind? No, I need to know where I can see him, bro. I need to be able to know. I, he needs to be in my, my, my fucking peripheral. You know what I'm saying? I need to be able to see this guy. How old is Gizmo? Gizmo's like six or seven years old now. Mitch really wants to get another dog, guys. And it's like... I don't know, bro. It's like I'm streaming all the time. She's working. You know what I mean? Like we already gotta like we already gotta leave Gizmo with her family sometimes or with like her sister. But like I don't know, man. Should I get another dog? You know what I'm saying? Should I get another fucking dog? You know what I'm saying? 
Gizmo, okay, so this is why she she wants to get another dog, but she wants to get another dog because Gizmo's getting older now. She wants Gizmo to teach his ways to the little dog. He wants Gizmo to teach his ways to the little dog. You know what I mean? To the, to the new dog. That way the new dog, I, no, I don't want a cat. Stop saying cat. I don't want no cat. I don't want to see cat. No cats. I don't do cats. I don't do cats, guys. I don't do cats. You know what I mean? I used to have cats. I I, I I used to have cats. I had cats and shit. I had cats. I just, you know, cats are like, cats are weird, man. Like, I fuck with cats, but cats are weird. Like, for instance, I'd have a cat, right? And that motherfucker would be up there on top of the shades and shit. He'd be on top of the shades all the way up there somehow, fucking hanging by his fucking paw or some shit. Like, fucking, you know what I'm saying? Like, he'll be fucking in some weird ass spot or something. Or I'll fucking, I'll go out there and somehow he's outside fucking on the railing just fucking looking at the, just doing some weird shit. Like he just, like cats are just fucking, they're all over the place, guys. They're all over, you can't control them. You know what I mean? They'll be here like, bro, I'd be playing, right? I'd be playing and then the cat would jump on a fucking table. Bro, if I'm playing fucking cod and the cat's jumping on the table... Yeah, bro, I don't know if I can do that, bro. I don't know if I can do it. Like, Gizmo's not jumping on the table, bro. He don't be jumping on the table and shit. Mine is pretty chill. You know what? You want to know what it is, guys? You want to know what it is? If I get a cat, it needs to be a cat I, I feel something with. Okay, I went to the, to, the, to the store once to go get Gizmo groomed, and there was this cat there. His name was Sprite. Okay? And me and Sprite had a connection, guys. We had a connection. Look, Gizmo's pissed off about it. He's pissed off about it because he know he saw the connection. He saw what we had, and he started to get a little. He started to get a little jealous. He started to get a little. Gizmo, I'm sorry. I know you. Gizmo, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. He doesn't like when I say that name. He doesn't like when I say that name. I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry. All right, but his name was Sprite, and he was. Guys, there was like little holes in the glass and he was putting his paws through the holes like trying to play with me and shit. Like trying to like, play, you know what I'm saying? I'm like playing with him and shit. Like, bro, I almost bought the cat right there, bro. I almost adopted the cat right there, bro. You know what I'm saying? It was like $300 or something just to adopt. But then I was like, I've never, I don't even know what to do with this cat. You know what I mean? Guys, I should have got him, guys. Guys, also, uh, for the Burbank event, we're going IRL. I'm thinking Santa Monica Pier. I'm thinking a Grove. I'm thinking, like, we're going to be in L.A., bro. There's so much to do in fucking L.A. You guys always talk shit about L.A., but I'm about to show you that L.A. is just fucking phenomenal and fucking absolutely fucking absolutely phenomenal. And do some IRL stream. We're going to do, like, a IRL GTA type stream. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Rob the jewelry store. You know what I mean? In GTA, of course. What's up, Pepsi? What up, bro? Hey, make out, exerve, monkey bomb, a millions, wood penguin. Thank you guys for the resource, man. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate y'all. Okay, let's get let's get back to this shit. CDO will increase existing event subsidy amounts for teams organizing live in-person events such as majors, opens, and champs. Um Okay, so what the fuck does that mean? Can somebody sum that up for me? I need can some what the fuck does that mean? What does that mean? CDO will increase existing events so the amounts for teams organizing live in person events. What, like more more events? Is that what is that was that what like more events? L reader, I mean, does that just mean more like more shit? You get a bonus for hosting an event. Oh, you pay them to host events. You pay more money for the events. They get got it. Got it. So teams are getting money for running events. Or it yeah, that's what it seems like. CDL will increase existing event subsidy amounts for teams organized. Yep, that's what it is. They're gonna they're gonna increase the. Yep, it's what it is, guys. That's what it is. Mm -hmm. You guys are right. Teams that host events will get a subsidy from the league for it. No, no, no. That makes sense. That makes sense, bro. Drag Ben. Ben's not in here, guys. Guys, Ben's not fucking in here. You want to know where Ben is today? T tell me where Ben is today, guys. Everybody, why doesn't why doesn't everybody comment down below where Ben's at? All right, everybody comment down below where you think Ben is today. Where you think Ben's doing fucking today. Wow, do you are you guys friends with Ben? How do you guys know that he's all golfing? How did you all know that he's fucking golfing? How did all you guys know that he's golfing and shit? No, actually, he's not golfing. I think he's at like a fucking... I don't know, bro. He's at like... Bro, I swear, every time I talk to Ben, bro, he'll be like... Be like, oh, no, bro, I'm going to this fucking uh, uh, Ohio crew uh, f football game. Bro, who the fuck is that? Like, what do you mean? 
Like, bro, he be going to, like, college games and fucking all kind. Like, bro, he just be going to a bunch of fucking things I don't even know. Like, he be saying teams I didn't even know existed, bro. Like, college teams and shit. You know what I mean? Fucking. I said, did you call Daniel Say yet about fucking Toronto? Oh, I haven't done it yet. I haven't done it yet, but, um. Yeah, I was thinking about giving him a call later because, you know, it was too early on the West Coast. I didn't want to call him too early on the West Coast. I said, Ben, I'll call him right now. Do you want me to call him right now? I'll call him right now because we need to figure this shit out. He goes, no, 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 I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. I got it. No, no problem. And now he's on, and he calls him. You know what I'm saying? He's like, you know. Here's a re Yo, that's Benjamin Asim right there, ladies and gentlemen. We need to get a wet spam in the chat. Now, listen. I don't like some of the negativity that I'm seeing on Ben's name. Okay? I understand Ben be yapping sometimes. Or I've told him. Stop fucking yapping. I told him. You know what I'm saying? I told him. You know? And, you know, sometimes, or most of the times, people don't agree with his cock takes. But, guys, there's other people. There's a lot of takes coming in. There's a lot of takes coming in. And, 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 and Ben... Is coming at is coming in from an outside perspective. Like, bro, some people I've went over this before, right? But I hate when I see comments like, <clears throat> "Get Ben off of this shit. He's never played COD. He has no idea what he's talking about." <laughs> Boom. I hate those comments. I hate those comments. And now there's gonna be people that come in the chat and say, "Oh, facts, facts, facts." But they're not looking at it as a whole. They're not looking at the bigger picture. It's good to have people on the show. It's good to have a person on the show who wasn't a professional player. That's good for the show, guys. That's good for the show. Because we have different perspectives. You know what I'm saying? Different perspectives lead to different conversations. Okay? That leads to better shows. Right? Right? It's good to have that counterpart. It's good to have that. That's why I do that. That's why I do that. Now, if you guys are just straight up annoyed because he be yapping so much. Yeah, me too. This motherfucking puppy. I told him. I fucking told him. I said, stop yapping. Last show, he didn't yap. Yeah, last show, he was phenomenal. Last show, Ben J was absolutely phenomenal. I had to call him off a couple times because, you know, he, he likes to get in the mix. He likes to get in there. You know what I mean? You gotta, you know Ben J. He's passionate about this shit, guys. I love that about Ben. He's passionate. He really wants to talk. I love the fact that Ben wants to talk. You know what I mean? So, I like Ben. Ben, Ben, And Ben's been with me since day one. He's been with me since day one. He quit on me. That's how I got everybody else. And he came back. And we're back in business. Boom. You know what I mean? It's just, uh, you know. It's my guy Ben J. It's my guy fucking Ben J. You know? How old is Ben? I don't know. 35? Teams will receive a two-year minimum guarantee of revenue so they can continue investing into the Call of Duty League. That is phenomenal. That is fucking phenomenal. I mean, guys, this is just W's from top to bottom. I mean, it can't get... Guys, this is W's from top to bottom. You know what? Hey, Lord Magquat, they would have a $5 donation. If everyone agreed on everything, it would be easy. Go fuck yourself? Well, yeah, no shit, Lord Ma. No fucking shit, bro. You know, that's just obviously very hard to do. You know, oh, it would be Z, 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 like, 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 sleep. Oh, never mind. Lord, but I read that in a completely different way. You're saying if everybody just agreed on everything, it would be a snooze. Yeah, no, Lord, but I, so I'm saying, bro, we need counterparts. We need people that have different opinions and we need people who aren't afraid to stand by their opinion. You know what I'm saying? And then I'll help host and facilitate the most important thing with the flank, guys. This is the most important thing with the flank. Okay. When I say move on, that's it. Everybody shut the fuck up. I'm the host. Me. And I, it, 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 we've been talking about this shit, bro. We've been talking about this shit. And obviously, sometimes things be really heating up, and it, it, I can't stop them, bro. I can't fucking stop them. You know what I mean? But, like, it, you know, it, they're not. You need the mute button and up and down points like a round of horn has. Would be funny if you teared up all the good and bad takes and could mute someone who's yapping heavily. Nah, nah, nah. We'd, nah, I definitely need to get a mute. Nah, the problem is when I mute people in TeamSpeak, right? When I mute people in fucking TeamSpeak, this is what I have to do, bro. I need to make the flank call locked. None of the co-hosts should be able to get into the flank call. That way, when we start the show... When we start the show, I drag them in. When we start the show, I drag them in, right? And then when they're when they're acting up and yapping, I drag them out, bro. Music too loud? Sorry. 
when I when I uh, when I drag them out, they're fucked. They can't talk because they're dragged out the call and they can't get back in. Cause I did that once, bro. I dragged Slayer out the fucking call because he was yapping once. I dragged. He joined right back and just started yelling again. He just joined right back and just started going fucking nuts again. I did that once, bro. I did that once. Why is so saying fucked up, bro? What's the problem, bro? Oh. What's the problem? <laughs> What's wrong, hey, bro? How Why, you doing? I'm live. Why so poking me stupid shit? Why you poking me stupid? You guys are the ones chilling in the main channel, bro. Why y'all chilling in the main channel? <laughs> That's you what I said. Told. Hello. You could have said hello, like hey. That's what I just. Well, I was in the middle of a rant. I was ranting. Listen, listen, Tommy. I retired for a day, and I I fear I might be back. You retired for one day, Jimmy? Yeah, and then they changed the whole format. No one wants you, bro. Jimmy, they're giving I'm a, everybody their money back. Like, it's crazy. It's Jimmy, like, I'm going to be honest. I, all it took was I haven't gotten there yet with my with the chat yet, but this got expansion written all over it, Jimmy. This got expansion written think, all fucking right? over like, it. Like, I got to be back. Jimmy, like, I'm not going to lie, right? If you're the Call of Duty League right now, you are looking to expand, bro. That will that will bring that energy back to the league. It'll bring that fucking hype back if more teams just get in and more people are getting in and there's more players, more teams, more going on. You know what I mean? Just more everything. More competition. More competition, more events, more Full cash, play. more dish, more matchups, more, more plays, matches. more money, more dish. I mean, it's more, more tickets, friendship. Uh, more friendship cheese. More, more fucking, I mean, more this fucking, could be fucking anything. I mean, if we bundles. get fucking more bundles, more narratives, more drama. Wow. More flanks. Me back in the league. Ladies and gentlemen, Jimmy Demons going to the league. Go we Knock on are seeing the future of the CDL. We are seeing more the yapping, future. More bundles. More yapping. More fucking yapping. I already yeah. know the future. What happened, so? Jimmy Demons is going to be the second biggest streamer inside wow. Prestige RP. Wow. Prestige Besides, RP is going to yep. be a new time for a lot of a people. Go. I think Prestige RP will be the start of something phenomenal. What do yeah, you think, guys? What do you think? I think it, mm -hmm. I think it could. Guys, we... Hey, anybody in the chat could play Prestige RP, by the way. Anybody could join up. There's going to be different prior listings and different things. And blah, blah, blah. Obviously, we want people to make characters, get in there. We want the thing to be active. We want this to be a fucking server for a long time. You know what I mean? I want this to be a fucking long time server. So, you know how servers are lit for a month and then they die? Yeah. I don't I want do. this to be that. I want this server to be lit around the clock. Always things going on. Always things happening. You know what I'm saying? And I'm smelling what you're stepping in. We're but I'm, stepping in. But I'm also, if you guys want to play some games later, you let me know. Some party games. We're helping in a ranked play right now with all We're the new guns. Game. Oh, really? phenomenal. I'm about to, I have a squad for ranked, some, unfortunately, for you guys. I'm oh, some mana call. fucked up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's the king. And Sam LaRue Cocktail. And there's also they, Tony, but, like, you know. They suck now. They're all retired. He's replaceable. Like, like, like you can get you a, you know. Get, nah, I don't know about that. I think Scum could still play if he wanted to. Tony probably get dumped on. Yeah, Tony, Tony's ass. Um, like Tony, Tony, Tony. Ain't Sam shit. could still fucking play if he wants to. You know what I mean? <laughs> I could still play if I drop the papaya for a couple what? weeks. If I drop the papaya for a couple weeks, I could probably no, get back just, in there. Yeah, no. you just drop it for the, you know, for for the, for the, event, for the afternoon. Yeah. You know what I mean? I drop you it for the event. I drop it for the event and shit. You know what I'm saying? Ah. You know what I mean? You need to do all that. <laughs> Yo, what the fuck bro. is this, bro? Yo, what is this, bro? Yo, that's hey, you run the Pabondi while you were while you were um, feeding anyway. Hey, I could just pull a Dan Ghosty. You know what I mean? Just rip that shit before I go live on uh, on stage. Before I go up there, you know. <laughs> Now, back in my day, Jimmy, I didn't smoke papaya uh, when I played COD. There was there was a period. Well, not during, but like you know after. Yeah, sometimes after, after. you're done for the day. No, I would. Don't, it would be like super late, like before I go to bed, help me sleep yeah. type shit. But yeah, I would never smoke like during the day or like before I played or anything like that. I would never do that. They say cap. You guys actually think I was smoking papaya before I went on stage? Are you guys crazy, bro? I would get dumped on. Like, I know it's worked for other people, but. Tom, I would get shit on, like, bad. No, like, yeah. I would actually get horked. Like, it would be chalked. 4 and 20. No. Okay, yeah, the 4 and 23, that was one exception. You know what I mean? Maybe he could have used the papaya there. Yeah, I could have probably fucking could've used it there. But... Focus on the lights. And... Exactly. Exactly. Yo, guys, I'm going to get back to this veteran. Let me know when you want to play some. I'll see you later. Nah. Take it easy. Channel switched. Uh. Sound muted.
All right, let's keep it fucking pushing. AJ Slade, King Griff. Thank you guys for the resubs. Yo, Stomp, see with a Twitch Prime. Prevail, see with a resub. Quarantine, give it a uh, donation. I almost said super chat. Respectfully, you're explaining why a non pro player, Ben, is able to have an opinion on pro players to non pro players. The chat. But respectfully, you're explaining why a non pro player, Ben, is able to have an opinion on pro players to non pro players. The chat. Yeah, no, no, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, no, no. That shit is funny, too. That shit is funny, too, though. You know what I mean? Hey, Nimbex, thank you for the 15 months, man. Thank you for the 15 months, Nimbex. Like, by everybody's logic, right? By, the, by that logic of Ben not being a pro cop player, like, you could say that about. The, everybody that just fucking comments about COD, you know what I mean? But their argument back would just be like, oh, but he's on a show, we're not, you know what I mean? But Ben's been in this uh, industry a long time, and, and I love that Ben has that, uh, like, for instance, for talks like this, Ben will be perfect for, like, when it comes to the business side and shit like that, because Ben knows a lot about this shit. Actually, guys, I've already talked to Ben. We're trying to see if Paul Hamilton wants to come on. Or if a team owner wants to uh, come on and talk about some of this shit, like get some team owners on. Um, so stay with us. Maybe we'll run a flank tonight and we'll get maybe, uh, some team owners on. If any team owners want to hop in and, and talk about some of this stuff, they, they are more than welcome to, cause we're probably going to talk about it. So, mm -hmm. Hey, Mike, uh, Mike Oxthick. Thank you for the 18 months, Mike Oxthick. Thank you so much, Mike Oxthick. Thank you, bro. Appreciate you, bro. Hey, correct so they were at 20 months and Cremant, they were at 25 months. I appreciate you guys, man. Guys, we're on a 68 sub trade. I mean, seriously, Chris is hitting, might get naked in the chat. If we get this shit to a fucking 100, to a 100 sub trade, he might get naked. Hey, Cardelli, thank you for the get this sub, Cardelli. Thank you for the get this, baby. Appreciate it, man. Let's get it. Come on, let's keep it pushing. Call of Duty League announces changes to the CDL team agreements. Okay, so wait. is that all the updates? Is there more updates to this situation, guys? I think the next logical question everyone is going to ask post this colleague announces whether this may lead to expansion to some extent any orgs y'all would want to see coming to the league and why. Look at Ben. Look at fucking Ben, man. This guy's a reporter, bro. This guy's a fucking reporter, man. You know what I mean? Imagine a CompCon Reddit team. We got to do it for the culture, boys. Reunited, KC, I mean, uh, Space Station Gaming, Rise Nation, United, C9, TSM, KC, Vitality, Fanatic, SK Gaming, TBDS, shit. My, I don't. A lot of orcs can come in chat. Who would you guys want to see? Vitality, SSG, every, some, there's just one guy in the chat that just keeps spamming. Refresh the Reddit. Refresh the Reddit. Refresh the fucking... Who's coming out of... 